everybody, it's Mario Fan 27 here from Mario Fan 27 Play, back with our episode of the Inglake Chronicle. In the last episode, we made it here to, to the south side of Blackwell Bridge, had the clearance request, and learned that Juju is heading off supposedly to Bible Valley on the Bionic Club. In this episode, we're going to be heading there, and, and for, to mention that in between episodes, like I mentioned, I just changed my equipment around. This is stuff I got. There's what Schultz looking like. There's what mine's looking like. And there's what Charlotte's looking like. Right? And off, I feel we got nine more block problems. We don't need any other game done for a block, 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 block collection quest. My goal bridge is actually pretty big and there's actually a big old lake under it. And you can see it, see it and go for it. So we, we can explore that lake. Coming from. But you know what, be are a bit careful when you are going like, you know, you reach Rapid Bridge North, so I mean, there's a landmark north and south. No, I didn't understand why, but I'm not going to question it. Make it more convenient for me. We have our cart here, which we can't do yet. So we go down there, 70, 70, level 75 green gobo and level 78 duck buttony gobo. I'm going to be careful. Nothing to say. Nothing to say. Nothing to say. Nothing to say. If we go across these bridges, there are also goals. Same, they're the same type. They're the same enemy that 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 the that that. that what was it? I, I don't remember that big level 81 you constant going around. I don't remember. Um, I don't remember, honestly. Well, I could be ashamed of myself, but... The level 81 unique monster that's rolling around. We have here, we got this little island here. It's got some oasis for me on it. I don't think I can have some significance if it... If it is... If it is a thunderstorm. Which pretty much you get the best method to try to rapidly change the time around. And see if you can actually get lucky on the cutaway to when I get a thunderstorm. And when right through that make the cut, that's when it happened. And right here when we do, White Eduardo. We can't lose. I don't want anyone dying. Right, it's literally right at two and I I made the cut when I changed the three o'clock. I got it. Alright, here's this break. I mean, I mean, it's always a fire that goes to change that topic and break the topic. Alright, so this I got the, I got that 
piece of equipment I wanted to put on him. See if I can put him to be on. Oh, yeah, I didn't put my name up on Gang Spawn. Does that matter? Cause we're just going to go ahead and have an opportunity to just rub like me later on anyway. But for now, I want to go ahead and head south. Along this bridge. The sounding islands are that make up the south. Oh. What's next to this bridge? This is when I'm trying to get to those islands. I'll find down for this bridge. I'm talking about the seas. The island, I guess. Right. Ah. The place I'm meeting, guys, I'm gonna try to get the bell down to the bottom. Can I jump it? Yep. There's a lot of ammo, though. Well, it doesn't matter, because we just go to the back of that. Where I want to go is I want to go to that cave. There's a little place we can go there. That has an Easter egg on top of it, and you can get a map. Got some very slow swimming. The tranquil grotto. It has a little shrine here. Oh, I'll remember that for a later part. Time later? Potentially much later, I don't, I don't know. Alright. I think by timing. Head back to the bridge. And I want to see like, how I'm doing on the quest and stuff. Did I get two quests left? Wow. Back to you guys, I just. Alright, then we're safe. Because. Well, I'm letting me do a vlog on the upper levels of, of, of the region for so going to get the Final Valley. And also a, a unique monster on the game in one part of Final Valley on the upper level. So you two things on the upper level. Not bad at all. Quick progressing fine game, of course, so once you can get both can get both them completed before doing everything at the place. At Final Valley. But anyway, we only got we only have three items left that we need for the entire plus key and that's not bad. We have our air pointing it towards that cave. So let's see what's up, up in that cave. Is this the place you were on about? This is it, alright. At the end of the road, there's a path to Colony 6. But there's no sign of Juju. If my vision was right, he should be around here somewhere. I'm sure he would have gone along this road. I just hope nothing's happened to him yet. Any chance he went up that way? It's not safe around here. I doubt Juju would go off the beaten track if he could avoid it. Got it. We'll search along the road. We'll search along the road, and yet he is not along the road. Because, spoiler alert, this is actually the way to call him sick, along Magwell Road. Is it actually, I'm pretty sure there's actually like proper enemies around here. We're just back on M64 and M63X's. Uh, maybe that's why I didn't go that way to the mech on. I won't probably want to rip his face off, but... But he, he went in this cave. We'll probably be coming back to that to this crossroad and going down that path to go to common six in, in the future. Yeah, I more. Bolt. It is where the hot pile will let me go out right now. We get so 75 Tempest Bang, well 74 Royal Caterpiles. But you don't have to worry about them because they're non aggressive. They only will fight if, they, if you join the fight. But there's also but there's level 71 Arachnids. So I want to be quiet here. And I think there's five, it's going to be like horrible. We can roll off through the windy cage. We also got some pods here, Pandora pods. I'm 
Loki. Just a little rock now. Uh, well. Lucky you. Yeah. What? Well, I'm changing the day. Time so I can see better. So I don't want to go by those rack now so I can avoid it. Here's that cave you can't get to, I see a lift in front of it. Alright, I, I think we're out of rack, I'm kind of coy. I'm gonna think it's a feat that Tempest Vang can get those third Vang, those Vang third molars. Probably not. And I'll be probably not, not being able to see them, but I'll probably drop it and it's almost going to be Yeah, some low level enemies and some high level enemies. Two words see blue and red right next to each other. It's a Tempest Bank or the cave entrance that we want to be extremely careful when heading in here, but I think there is something good if we're heading in here. I want this way. Once we head in here, we got these large Pandora pods. And a level 75 Mysterious Barnaby. I'm glad I didn't have to step in there. I'm pretty sure we have to come here for something for later. Now I remember. So let's remember that place for later because of this quest. Can you see that looks like a file? That looks like a file. Probably because that, 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 we're actually in a file valley right now, under it. Basically, what we need to try to do at this point is just we have to wrap around and head to the upper level of the leg. We just do a cave. Do some more. Actually, we don't want to be surprised by that tier thing because vision these guys will attack things. Seeing a fight going on, so we don't want to join the fight. But then they will also want to be quiet. So at least if you try not to walk near them. I got some more tier things here, but I feel safe for those guys not disturbing us when we're going through. Try to fight one more little way. I'm gonna have to try to fight all these guys. Oh, give me a minute. Go for the Manana Buster. And there goes the Manana. That's actually not too bad. As you can tell from the damage. No, and also keep looking at Ryan's skill bar. Which I think I'm gonna get. What are you trying to do? I think that's a certain number. So we can't find him now. I did not mean to look in quest law, I meant to look in the achievements. What do you think about this? rare treasure chest, but it's right, rare and silver. We got a big wall of each of the in here. There's actually multiple deposits in it. And it's now yeah, probably. Now, since Ryan learned his skills, I don't know if I want to keep him on that skill branch. I don't know if I want to keep him on that And you can put him back in spirit. But then I want to go ahead and see if I can put some heavy armor stuff on him now. And you can see it. You see it, what it is, what it says, a medium, that's a, that's light, light, that's light, oh, that's medium, all that stuff is light, we can only have stuff to have is this, what did he have there? I'm not for one. Defense, but also raises his physical defense by quite a bit and gives him a lot more strength. Well, at least, 
see by a lot. It's got four weight. It's only at one. I think it's just fine. And I think I honestly can go ahead and make that skill. Yeah, I can, I can link it, so I'm going to link the heavy armor skill. There we go. So now Shulk, be, now Shulk can go ahead and equip that that be what, so choose it too. Which I don't know if I want to because I would cut his speed down quite a bit. It's 70, but I don't know. I think, I think I'm fine with that for the time being. I'm just going to pass him like this. And there we go, if you meant to. You know, probably could if I just did that last time. Alright, heading back through here. Careful because there's some more level 70 Arachno. So do I have to approach here? Oh, cut through here. I don't want, I don't want to die today. I had another thing that's stronger than like anything else in the area. Aside from the aside from the tempest bangs and the counter pile. And that last mobile mobile. Mobile. But I don't see why that why there's level 76 enemy that just blow me around here. I don't even know what I'm doing right now, so I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what Waterfall, man. Am I going the right way? I think I'm feeling I'm not going the right way. If I'm not, I'll... If I'm not, I'll know soon. Yeah, we got some gear things here. Now we got some Yeah, I'm... Yeah, I, I remember going. I remember going to Terry like a lot later, and I'll and play through. I think I can go the wrong way, but you can see some of the sites, and some stuff will be coming back for a lot later, like another thing just last level seventy last local. Yeah, I definitely went the wrong way. I took a wrong turn somewhere. But while we're here, you see like some like with these branching pads. All right, bye bye. I'm just gonna fall off. Come on. I'm falling in. All right, that should take me back to the bridge. That's what's gonna take me back to Waterworld Bridge. I mean, yeah, it's back wherever I took a long turn. I'm not going crazy, but it's a block. I'm directly under where I need to go. You don't have to climb up here. So this, okay, this is a path that takes you up there, but I'm pretty sure that you blocked off by rocks. Yeah, I don't think you just climb up here at this point. I think you blocked off by rocks. Because the two paths that on the bottom are take it to that cave that had that level 75 unique monster. The, the, the branching path up here, where we just went. I don't know what else to try to do, but I think I might have been wrong in saying what path you have to go down between going in that cave or going down this road. For sure, I think now in hindsight, you have to go down the road. But going all the way through that cave took me to a place that I would not I would not normally go until the end of the game. 
because I get the level 70 plus enemies and unique monsters. But do we have to head this way? There's nothing else I'm going back based on the fact that one, there was mech on here, which makes me think I'm going the right way of the probably mech on that tough you do, and two, the mech on that are about my level. Thinking that this is the way we're supposed to go. Something else tell me this is where you're intended to fight the N64s. And I think I was right, because I think I'm on the second level. Yes. Quite stronger. Ah! So we'll on the second on the on the higher level. Alright, so the next one are gone. Oh right, good thing I'm here. No, anyone. Don't think I mentioned that quote yet, but. I know it's come up a couple times. I tried to be just laughing at it. But I believe we're, we're heading in the right direction now. I'm not a complete idiot. But I was right in saying it's led to Colony 6, because this is that, the path to Colony 6. That's like through there. Maybe that's like some sort of good travel point we can get up here. I want to say. I am stone. I don't get a point up here. It better be. Really? No mind it look, it's probably like right up like kissing column six. But I don't feel like going through that map right now. We're going to head back across the bridge. And we're going to turn it the daytime. So we can have dark playing at the end of the day. It's at 5 o'clock. There we go. The big frog, though, that's the thing we need to get. Don't let a single one escape. I'm hoping this thing will be nice to me and get. And something I never mentioned, there's still blue, blue. The, the blue 16s that are popping up like that, that's my lightning attack. That's my, that's my lightning attack. I'm going off on shore. I'm going to slimy tongue. So I don't know if that's just something we're going to get into much later, but no.
Another new symbol's appeared on the Monado. Can I save her? Of course you can. I 
tentacles. This is a red art. <laughs> you only get legendary tentacles for power arts, which are white. And tentacles, you go ahead and activate the Monado and do Monado speed. And what's that? And what's Monado speed? It, that increases your agility so much that it blocks the arts from even hitting, hitting the character. That said, it only works on one character, unlike Monado shield. But anyway, Adventure with Monado Buster. Short my time is up. 
Three times and hardly has it seven minutes. Mr. Sims, that's pretty funny.